you have a lot of games on the eShop. You have lots of great games, like all the Nintendo games that everybody knows and loves. Sometimes you find some great deals, some games that are just on the cheap. And you think, hmm, maybe this is the day that I should purchase a good game. And if you're on a search for a good game, or dare I say, a quest for a good game, this one's three cents. How bad could it be? I earned one point for that purchase. Thank you, Duck Game. It says it's inspired by a classic game. Oh, oh wait, it has a story? Oh, I didn't actually see this before. <laughs> Lord by the rumors of untold treasures. Ooh. In an abandoned castle, you stumble upon a secret tunnel some prisoners used to escape from its dungeon. Your quest is to find the fabled golden duck, a magical artifact of limitless power. You got PvP that I can't really do. They got a single player campaign. They got a hundred handcrafted levels. I hope they're not all randomly generated Pac-Man style levels. Maybe I'm maybe I'm wrong. The sale <laughs> lets you buy it for three cents. Seems to be going on until the 14th, so it's not terrible. I can just tell people at the end, hey, three cents. Buy game. Now, I have no intentions on jabbing at this game for its art style, for anything it does. I just want to see how it acts as a game. So we're gonna go on in here. We're gonna see what happens when we go. I'm liking that the golden duck honestly looks like- oh, oh it just- oh, alright, <laughs> alright, it's just like that. There are five levels, it's not a hundred levels, I'm playing by myself. Oh wait, can we be the dog? We cannot be the dog. I'm gonna be- I'm gonna be the original one, cause this one- I, I like- I like the blue hair. Lord by stories of- oh, no, it's the- oh, it's the same- it's the same information as before. <laughs> now, the font here is not, is not too bad. It's like, you see how the S's are like, kind of a little more blurry than, <laughs> than some of the other letters in the text? I'll just, we'll, we'll, we'll look past that, we'll look past that. I'll just, uh, I'll just hurry up and collect all the gold to get it up. We're just going and we can't... Oh! Oh, that's not a text box, that's just in the wall of the level. <laughs> so what it says we need to do is we need to get all the coins before the timer runs out. Or we can't get a bonus life. And, uh, I think I messed this up by just reading that for a little too long. I don't really know if we're getting that bonus life. Ah, uh, no... Darn it. No bonus life for me. Oh, yes. You beat the level. Thank you. No, 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 no. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Some evil force is at work here. Although the prisoners have been dead for decades, their bodies seem animated, and the guard dogs are still alive. I keep feeling like I want to hit the A button. And like, you know, get rid of the text on the screen? But I'm not able to do that, because it's just not an option? Oh, it didn't... It didn't clap for me as long that time. They just kind of went, yay! Why? <laughs> the screen went grayscale just to know we're done. How does he escape? So you have to collect all the gold, and then you can escape, right? But, so you're, you're, you're the guy, right? And you're running, and you're running, and you're running away from the people over there. It's just a dead end. A bunch of spikes comes out, ending your adventure prematurely. All right. So like, is there an animation if I get hit by the traps? I want to kind of, I kind of want to find out. You know what? Eh? <laughs> nice. It, it doesn't reset the spikes after you like lose one of your lives. It's like, what if you walked away from this area? You wouldn't be able to go back and get the coins. What? Okay. <laughs> I heard, <laughs> I heard the beeping and it, the beeping sound sounds so close to someone who's like, dropping an f-bomb or something and getting like you know getting bleeped out on the television that i was like Ugh. hey wait this is one of the levels that was locked though right so i think we're actually getting to some new stuff that we couldn't get to before you stare at a huge pile of gold across a wall of spikes and then you notice a secret stairway leading below the floor i didn't check if there's like diagonal movement yet but oh okay it actually it, it did actually try to help me there it didn't make me walk immediately onto the spikes i'll give it that i'll give it that I now have six, <laughs> six bonus lives. Guard dogs run straight to the corridors, never turning at the crossroads. If they spot you, they will start running directly towards you and will keep running straight even if they lose sight of you. Ooh, rah. oh no, 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 no. <laughs> Who's a good boy? Who's a good boy? Oh no, oh no, no, no. <laughs> oh wow, okay, the AI is, it's a very soft AI. 
Can I let the dog walk past me? And then can I get all the coins before I get bopped? Oh! Oh! <laughs> so these dogs don't understand the idea of checking behind a wall. But if you come behind them when they're not looking, he immediately turns around. Like, does, do, do they have perfect vision in front and behind them, but not like down a wall? There we go. We're so good at video games. As soon as you find yourself in a tight spot, pick a secret passage carefully. Oh, is there gonna be like one secret passage that's gonna just get me totally bopped? Okay, there are two staircases. Where do these go? One goes over here to a hilarious dead end where you will probably get dogged. <laughs> mm, I love teleportation stairs. Oh, this is level six. Remember they said there were over a hundred levels? That's, that's looking like over a hundred levels to me. We're at six. All right, oh, oh. Oh, okay, you can, oh, okay, hey, 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 who's a good boy, who's a good boy, who's a good boy, ha <laughs> oh, all right, all right, you win, game, because I don't think you can get away from this, right, can a dog follow down the stairs, okay, no, he can't, but, oh, okay, he does, he does go away for no reason, oh, oh, <laughs> um, yes, Following the trail of coins, you run into a huge gem, 2D Pac-Man. <laughs> As you pick it up, some powerful energy starts flowing through your veins. For a couple of seconds, you feel invincible. Oh, so it's... Ah. It's kind of... Oop. Oop. What was that? What was that sound effect? What was that sound effect? Can I, can I have a replay, please? So just run in a random direction so they won't chase me. You know, that's, okay, yeah, they do not chase you. All right, all right, all right. I'm, I think we go at like the same speed. So I gotta keep that in mind. I think I was like slightly faster than the dog or maybe like the same speed. These necromancers, ooh, are really smart. When they hit a wall, they never go back the way they came from. Now I feel like this would inspire me to try and plan out my fight against the AI, but you're gonna see me not do that. Hey, buddy, hey, 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 hey. Hey, hey, hey. <laughs> yeah, there you go. Just, uh, just go that way. Thank you. Uh, uh, <coughs> yes. Uh, so, level 10. What if we throw all the bosses at you at once? I know they're not bosses, they're just characters, but as you pick up another one of those magic gems, the enemies start running away from you. Apparently they can sense the power and it horrifies them. Now, the way that the text looks, it's just like, horrifies them. <laughs> Who's a good boy? Who's a good boy? Uh, give me, give me. <laughs> I want that to be the sound in Splatoon. Like when you fight, when you get, get a kill, instead of like enemies going like, <laughs> like dying normally, just go, yum. <laughs> oh, do they just, oh no, they do not stay in there forever. No, 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 that's, that's not what they do. Do, 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 do. Come on, just, uh, just go the other way, all right? I feel like this invincibility stays for a pretty long time too. Ah, uh, well that's, that's 10 levels of this great game, the quest for the golden duck. I don't think I'm going to do any more, but I just want to see what's next, just in case. Completely different. Nothing, nothing like the other levels. Nothing at all. Suddenly your whole body becomes transparent, almost invisible. Use this new power to sneak behind the dog. Isn't that just going to... I mean, I'm pretty sure you can't, okay, can we, can we tap the dog? No, 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 we can't, no. Seems very, very simple, we just needed one. How, how are you supposed to go around also and get all these in what seems to be about 30 seconds time? Oh, can, can you, can you stop being here so I can go get the one coin I didn't have over there? All right, just do it this way. Oh, so you, you can still be invincible and be invisible at the same time. Interesting. I did it. <laughs> but I think I've had my fill for now. So, I closed out of level 13, right? That's so I could end this thing and, and, and move on to something else, like to, to continue this video in some way or form. And the first thing that I notice is that I hit play adventure mode, right? It doesn't save the fact that you won on the previous levels. So I was like, okay, maybe I just have to like close it out and reopen it and then I'll like, get my progress back. But that isn't the case. 
<laughs> I mean, I guess it's what you get when it's three cents, but this game normally costs $9.99. So shouldn't they have thought about that? Like maybe, hey, you should make sure that the game actually saves properly. I, I guess when you want to play this game, you got to play all 100 levels nonstop without playing anything else on your Switch. Or you're not going to be able to ever get to the end and get the golden duck. <laughs> So on my quest to understand this game further, I went over to the Steam store and I was like, let me look at some of the reviews it's got. And the first review that I see when scrolling down is from Ducky Goes to War. And all he really wants, he just says, I just want to find that golden duck. And currently this game is on sale, which is pushing some people to buy it. On Steam, it's $2 right now, whereas on the Switch, it's like nothing, <laughs> as we showed before. But this one review of someone who bought it very strongly on sale wrote, Pure nightmare fuel. Horrible. I'll give it this. It's playable, it was worth my three cents, and it is a game. So, uh, we'll give it, we'll give it, a, we'll give it like a three out of ten. That sounds pretty good. We'll give it a D for duck. <laughs> See you later. Hope you enjoyed.